Hey, YouTubers, it's your boy Domination. This is back in the base. You're gonna do this. I would do text, baby. Man, that was back. You know what it is. Again, the only place, all the 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 place, go get it. All the place, go get it. All the place, all the place, all the place, go get it. All the place, go get it. All the place, go get it. It's right back with base. They're gonna do this. I would do text, baby. Man, that was back. You know what it is. No, this, no, this. Real men rise up. Fake men rise down. Real women rise up. Real women rise up. Fake women rise down. Practice what I preach and preach on. <clears throat> you know, uh, dark, uh, uh, black pride. I saw your video. You was talking about black, black females are are rated, rate, uh, 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 rate, rating it part two. Man, I I understand where you coming from. But it, it, it's not just us, brother. It's not just us. It's every other national race. See, that's women, one thing about women you have to understand. Not all, but most of them. They know the, the, the men, they know the secret weapon that women will use, what she got between her body. I mean, not every single woman. Women use her mind, her spirit, and her accomplished goals. But most women... They know man's biggest weakness. They they know they know. Just like this is this is what well, women's biggest weakness is men. It's always men. But man's biggest weakness. The problem with dudes nowadays, their biggest weakness is always pussy. Let's be honest. You know, especially white guys and black men. I'm gonna tell you something about black men. The problem with black men, we don't know how to. We want to still play checkers, but not playing chess. We need to start playing chess instead of playing checkers. You got to guard your peace sometimes. If you don't guard your peace, you will lose your peace. And once you lose your peace, you're going to lose part of yourself. That's what black men fucked up at. We, we, we got we to gotta understand women and, and how to deal with women and how to treat women. That's just the, our main problem right there. But a lot of, not just men guilty of this. Women are guilty of this. Because a lot of times, when they look at a man, they judge a man on based on his, his, uh, his uh, I guess, appearance, appearance of his dick size, the way he lived, the way he making money. Every woman is guilty of this. If he don't make a certain kind of cash, a certain kind of money, order to keep that woman to, to make her sexually f satisfy her, I mean... Not every single woman like that, but see, it's not their fault they do this. It, it, we live in a world is live be matriarchal. We live in matri matriarchy. That's just the problem because you got to bring something that's bring offer to the table. The problem with black relationships nowadays is that as a black man, like I said again, they always you always hear this that they they brothers got to work so hard to order to make an an accomplished ladder. Of course they do. Because let's be honest, we have our moments, we have our days, but where we fucked up at, we 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 we, we think that well, because we got a Barack Obama. Look, look how they treat Barack Obama now. They treated this man like he ain't shit. If I was Obama, I'd be packing right now. If I was him, I'm gonna tell you something. I met a lot of black men like that. They they kind of like nice brothers type. Th those type, yeah. The want to say I'm the good black man. I'm the good black man. I don't care how good you is. You need to understand. You got a target in your head. You need to understand that. And and there are people out there want to try you. And I'm trying. I'm trying to let you know how some people can be. Even women will try it. If you're, or if if you act a certain way, she gonna think, well, something wrong with him because most men she interact with is an asshole or a bad boy. There's three types of men that women like to interact with. There are good guys. The problem with good guys, they they buy them everything. They 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 pay pay all the all the way from the for the ornament of their dinner. Make sure the dinner is on time. The dinner, the, you know, make sure they they arrive on time when they go to dating. There's nothing wrong with good guys doing that. Good guys need to stop doing so much. This is why women always use the nice guys. They look at them. Oh, he saw. Oh well, you 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 like a brother to me. You when you hear a woman say something like that, she's basically saying you're a bitch. You need to stand up to her. Why you think when women when they get around men they act a certain way? 
Now, I'm not saying all of them. I'm saying some of them. When, when they get around a bad boy and judge, she act totally different. And that's everyone. I don't care if women get mad at me for saying this. This is true. I, I notice it. And I can put a hidden camera and I say, you see how y'all acted? Y'all act totally different. They knew those dudes are losers. They knew they ain't shit. And you ain't got to tell them. She got to learn it the hard way. See, that's why I don't say anything. I mean, they, they you hear these TV shows nowadays. They always keep blaming, blaming about the guy. Oh, he did this to me. He treat me this way. Why do you think he did that shit to you? Because he, he knows in your mind, well, I'm going to do it once. I might as well do it again. And some men are arrogant. They get cocky. They get cocky as a motherfucker. That's why they do the shit they do. Some of these women are arrogant. I ain't going to lie. You, you hear this all the time. Can you imagine if there was no women in this world? There'd be there'd be a lot of men out here be strumbling the mud in the football field and tearing up the goddamn place because they, because they look at men as the of the cause of evil anyway. And let's be honest, a lot of that is some guy's fault. Why some women be in the certain things they is. Look at the stuff that women got to deal with. They got to deal with her body start changing when she get a certain age. That's why dudes need to be careful when they have sex with a woman, especially if she's on her 20s. When she's 16 and 14 and 15, you got to be careful because her body is going to change. And now, because of that, they will use that advantage. They're going to stick with the side with the women. They're gonna look at the, they always say uh, uh, innocent, uh, innocent women and children. They don't say innocent men because some men are not innocent. Even if he's innocent or not, they're going to still think he should have sex with her and just left her behind. Let's be honest. Most men are guilty to this. So, fellas, we we can't we can't complain some of the stuff that we're doing. We got to look back and say, do we did that? We if, if you don't want to be with that woman, you need to let her know up front. And women need to do the same damn thing. They keep saying they want a good man. Bullshit. If women do want a good man, they always talk about it's a short breadstick of the man. Well, let's say if we ha if a woman got a breadstick right now, what does she do when she get a breadstick? She's going to bro two different sticks that is it, it, going to fill her up. Basically, I mean, fill her appetite. She's going to say, I want more breadsticks. And then let's say it's not enough breadstick because they keep, they keep breaking the men apart. This is why women have a hard time finding a good man in the society. G good men is just like the visible man. They see they see him, but they don't see him. And you see that all the time in our community. You, you see it, especially in the black community. That's the main problem in the black community. That's why brothers got to work so hard going to college. I did that. I, I understand that some dudes just go to college, just try to prove women. I got something better qual for my life. Let's let's get married, baby. Let's have a family. You know, I understand how frustrated it is. I understand how hard it is that you got to prove yourself to the world and say, okay, I got my stuff together. Even if you still get your stuff together, they still ain't satisfied. Only way she's going to be satisfied too, she's satisfied herself. What you've done for her, what you've do, done for you and all that stuff. It used to be the time it wasn't always like that. See, that's, I'm going to tell you what, what the man's biggest problem is. We need, we, need, we need to understand how to deal with women, how to talk to women, how to treat them. And so, so long, the same thing, women got to learn how to deal with men, how to treat men, and how they, how they, how they, how they you know, how they uh, learn about uh, uh, how to talk to a man. I mean, this is the main problem. And you see this. Now, now I'm gonna say this: the black men, we can be the most during the most hated. That's 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 the main problem. But the thing is, we act like we the most masculine, masquerade black men in on this planet. Let's be honest: when you see it in our culture, they think they believe in this whole mandingo, African dingo ness. Oh, we got the biggest, uh, 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 larger men of penis than any other man. And I'm telling you, a lot of people, a lot of men, black men, buy, buy into this stereotype. And that's not even true. You got white guys do to have the same same size as brothers. But this is the thing that you hear this a lot. I mean, white guys can't hump as good as black men. You you hear this. A lot. I don't buy in this because only thing you can hump very good. The more you float the ocean, the more you cru cruise the potion. You that's what I look at. It doesn't it doesn't matter what race it is. You can rock a woman real good. It doesn't matter what race you can become. 
as long as you sex and fab, as long as you keep them around, as long as you pay your pay your bills, as long as you you you, you spend spend time with her, she spend time with you. You've been faithful to her, she's been faithful to you. If y'all are not don't want to be around each other, y'all need to see other people then. Instead of sticking each other around, you can't just play around and then be faithful. It just don't work like that. But what kills the game is simping. That's that's why I, I mean for all my ATL people, but I got I'm sorry I have to say this, but you know, tricky you got it. That 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 really killed the whole scene of dating. It it really is. I ain't gonna lie. Because AT, not every ATL down with this tricky till you got it mindset. Cause that's why I love the song, but I love the, I hate the concept that tricky till you got it. And trick, you just have to trick somebody till you get some. That, why do you think they meant tricky till you got it? And, and and but they wouldn't go over there in Cali. Cali ain't with that shit. Cause trick, cause and, and back in, in in that time, they look at trick and get your ass killed. I'm I'm tell you something. If you go to California. They ain't with that. I don't think Detroit with that too. Cause one thing about Detroit, Detroit is the biggest uh, 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 player holders out there, especially when it comes to women and uh, Milwaukee. Milwaukee got some beautiful women down there. The most sexiest women, I would say, Detroit, uh, Milwaukee. They said Milwaukee got some sexy females down there, and they also Florida. Oh my God, Florida is gorgeous women down here. It's gorgeous women over there in Florida, but I'm gonna tell you something else, man. We as men, we need to learn, you know, because th th this is the problem. We could be the most during more hated, especially black men, and that's the problem with black men. We're we're the low end in the day for the low end towing boat, you know. The only time they they gonna fuck with black men if he got to come with some money, he had to come up in the world. That's the only time they'll fuck with him. But if he don't make a come up and make a name for himself, he ain't gonna get no woman. He not. He not gonna get no woman. And the thing about white guys, white guys, man, they they the kind of guys, man, they have to live. They 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 have to have a certain way of way of certain certain make 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 it make it make it, make it a, a precedent and make a certain make a certain having a privilege of themselves when they come get women, especially white guys. I can't say because some white guys they can get women. They can get women. They can, especially if they if if they, they have the certain privilege they got. They can get many they can get many women they can get. But you would never hear about them having babies by different women. You would never hear them. If you do, they will never put that out. And what do they say about black men getting women? Oh, he got some kids somewhere. That, 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 I'm telling you, black women will say this. And even every other race of women say this. Even white guys will say this as well. But yet, it can be other races of men. This is why they look at black men. We just the lowest of lowest scum of men and the lowest walking scum on the earth. But yet, white guys are still remain the, uh, the winning breads in the world that still can get women. But they can be fucked up, fucking their secretary, their babysitter, and fucking their uh, uh, clean up maid in their house. Come on. You know, I mean, you and go to sex trips. Black men go to sex trips, but the thing is, first thing I hear about, they're gonna spread some A's, they're gonna spread some Z's. That that's the first thing they think of black guys when they when they have sex. But white guys can spread the D's too. But the thing is, as long as he got some extra money, to actually make a living for himself, he can get any woman that he can get. And and, and you know, and Latino man. You don't very hear about Latino men. Only time you you hear about Latino men when they get when they bring that Latino lover down on them. I mean, they bring Latino lover down on 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 the on the playbook and say, yeah, mamacita, you know, you know the Asian guys. On the other hand, they 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 have to be re rescue of falling distress when 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 they get a woman because Asian men had it hard. I ain't gonna lie because you one first first thing you hear about Asian men. They fall, they fall to permit to marry type because for Asian men you barely don't hear of them about cheating their women. But the first thing you hear about white guys or black men, especially black men, that's all you hear. You look at TV shows, you look at image, images, everything. What goes on in the world? Even Oprah always talk about black men. That's why Oprah will never talk about other race of men. First thing she gonna do, she gonna talk about black men. 
talking about 70% of black women are single. All of this going to push this image. Well, black women might as well date outside of race. Then go ahead. Ain't nobody stopping them. But don't, don't, don't expect that people going to treat you any different. And that goes to brothers. Just because you tired of certain system, you can date outside your race, date a white woman. Don't expect they're going to treat you any different. They still going to hate the bullshit you do. And that goes to anybody. I, I, that's the problem. Everybody needs love like everybody else. If, if white guys need love to get to get some love in the world from a woman, and Latino guys, Asian guys, Asian, I mean, I mean, and Middle East guys, Native American, every guys, even black men need love. White women need love. Black women need love. Every woman, every race of women need love. But the problem is about men. Men's biggest weakness is always, always, always pussy. It's always pussy. That's why dudes act a certain way. That some dudes will go to jail behind a woman. Some dudes will kill a man over a, fo- a female. Some dudes will will, will 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 kill a woman all because she got he got mad at her. Oh, she can't give me no damn pussy. And some dudes encourage you to do this the way they're doing, man. You, and then they get and then, and then when they when they get the girl that you want. Then you get mad. They're going to say, man, you just getting mad. You just mad because you ain't getting no pussy. You, you, you hear this all the time. That's the problem. And and us, most dudes, they fuck it up for every other man out there trying to get females. Dudes going to, dudes gonna, uh, a, a man going to be a man regardless. But men do need to think about what they're doing when it comes to getting females out here. Most of these men don't give a fuck. When they see a fine-ass piece of chick... It'd be five, six, seven dudes go after her. Now, that's every man, but it's always black men. They make it seem like black men are the only ones who do this. And that's every man. Every man, like even white guys like this. I was watching a movie called uh, uh, Europe Europe Trip or something like that. It was like, uh, I don't know how many thousand. It was like tw- 20, 20, 20. Uh, t- uh, twenty thousands of men are going after this one white chick, and they just after her. That 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 that's simple. That's thirsty right there. They, when men don't have nothing to offer in this world, nothing to lose, especially he ain't got no money, he ain't got no transportation, he ain't no job. Of course he's gonna chase pussy. Of course he's gonna do. It. That's like stealing a bag of grits of cheeseburger and, and and thinking you hungry and you gotta you ain't have no full stomach. And you're going to take some extra amount of cheeseburger. You're going to do that because in your mind, well, I, I, I got to eat. I got to do this. This is why men act the way they are. Because let's be honest, black women, some black women, they not always want it physically, but they want it mentally and sexually. What I'm saying is they got the best body of work, of fe- best body of, 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 of figure of work than any other race of females. White women got the best of eye and, uh, and best of eye of seeking out the beauty. There's something beauty about white chicks, and they got it like that. Especially she got a pretty cute face, and, and but they, they ain't gonna let no dude push a damage on her. How much beautiful of a beauty that she had. This is why they put white pe- women on the pedestal because there ain't nobody is more beautiful and 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 and, and, and gracious than her. And that bothers the fuck out of black women. That bothers just as much as bothers black black men when white guys establish a country, establish of a global scale, global world. Let's be honest. Most white dudes, they look at the world as revolve around them. If it ain't revolve around them, it revolve anything else. They outsport and sport things. My uh, my cousin told me about that. He ain't lying about white dudes. White people, they they like to be a, a, a life explorer and, and certain life of adventurement. White people are really like that. This is why that that nobody is not into the activities they do. Unless you be the first one, you can be you can be the only brother up in there to get in that world. This is why they always say it's the white man's world, but it really is. It's just enough of white men. Uh, 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 co- of an instruction, instruction of 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 of, of activity achieves in the world. That's what that's what it is. Black men, the only problem is what we have. We got to show ourselves. We got this this swagger, jacker. We we swag and we jack everything that we do, and we 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 the we the we the uh the 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 seek of 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 a of a, of a, of a taste the glimpse about us. 
And this is why the thing is black bled. We got to learn sometimes when we deal with women, you got to play with chess, not checkers. Checkers just easy. All you're going to do is take each piece of checkers that you do. Play chess. Chess is the hardest thing to do. Chess is it just like checkers. But the thing is, you got to grab each piece that piece that you can and grab one piece. It's better to have one piece and not have all the pieces that you can have and need. That's why we always talk about a woman is a dime piece. But we need to we need we need to have a a, a, a worth an inch of a dime, but a, a collector of lucky dime with what's worth more more precious to us. Remember that movie, uh, Lord of the Ring. Uh, there goes my precious. You know we we are like that. We like the grim of the reaper mint of this 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 garbage poem. We just when we want something, we just like oh there goes my precious. You we so obsessed with it. It's, it's disgusting. White guys, they've been seen as like, they like to howl and hide and heat is, and heat in this. When they get a woman, it'd be a couple of them grabbing each by different cups of grip, different of, of taste of grip of meat, every grip and out of their teeth. And, 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 and just, and just hold it like a beast together. Just, you just hunger. You just hunger more. They hungry like a wolf. White white dudes like that. When they see a woman, they just they just gravitate. It just gravitize. They appetize with it. Like oh, black men. When we think all that we think is pressure, we want to worship. We want to uh, uh, the touch them. And it's it's like I can't explain it. But there's a difference between black men and white men. It is. But us as black men, we just the worst of the lonely pole when it comes to women. Fellas, what we need to do if we want to have a females in the world, there's nothing wrong getting sex, but please be careful when you get out there in the world, because I ain't going to lie, because every time you hear something on TV about brothers having babies by different kids, and, all, and that, that really pissed me the fuck off, but this is how other races see us. They see us just like that, but but they know different. You got uh, white guys that fall on the sideline, when they see a chick, they just they just you know, attract certain magnet and they stuck to it to the female till they couldn't get it off of her. But what we do is black men, we see a woman, we 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 we, we when we see a woman, we just we just we just stalking ourselves around and thinking that we looking for some some desperate destination. So brothers be careful when you deal with some women out here because I ain't gonna lie. We deserve what's what's the best we qualify and the best of qualification for ourselves. So if dark one son, I understand where you come from. It's not just us, it's everyone else. We just have to have a, a, a better, greater, and better than we are the the better what we are what we are to come. That's all. And that's all I got to talk about today. It's your boy Domination. This is back at the base. It's you're gonna do this is how we do taste, baby. Until next time, all right? All right, peace in the mouth.